Hey guys, so today we're going to be printing with the TiVo Tarantula Pro. I'll put a link to the video where I assembled this. I'll put that up in the corner. Um, when I put the kit together, I wasn't too sure about it, but after the first true print came off of it, I was kind of hooked with it. So we're, we're going to try an even bigger print this time. It's going to be this articulated octopus that I found on Thingiverse. I'm going to size it up to 150%, so cover a good portion of the build plate. And I think it'll look really cool on camera. I just can't wait to see what this looks like. Anyway, guys, let me get it all set up, and I'll see you at the end of the time lapse. Okay, so that was six hours and 11 minutes, and it looks pretty good from what I'm seeing. I get, did heat the bed back up a little bit. It's up to, oh, 50 degrees Celsius. That should allow me to hopefully break everything loose here without turning up that build surface. There we go. They are all loose right off the bat. So the only thing I see that didn't turn out very good is the this mouth or nose or whatever that's supposed to be there. You can see some strings underneath it there. Um, but once again, I didn't use any supports at all. That's just pure just cooling. The eyes look really good. Don't see any drooping in the eyes. Even on the inside there, I don't know if you can see that. It's a little bit of stringing, not bad at all. Bridged off pretty good. Tentacles all free. No, uh, none of them are stuck. It definitely printed as it was supposed to. That is cool. Hey, not bad at all for, for a quick print on it. <laughs> um, Trying to see if there's any problems with layer lines. It looks pretty smooth. Like I said, that right there is the only the only issue I see is right there. But everything else, I don't see any problems at all with that. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. Have a great day. Take care, and I'll catch you in the next one.